lost children. You disappoint us. Betray us. Shed the blood of your own. No one hurts you more than family. Join us in the light. We won't ask again. Hmm. You won't. But not for the reason you think. I don't understand. Why aren't you? To mass produce the serum, you diluted my sample. Yes, it protected you from the sunlight, but each use of your powers burned more of it away. You are, as they say, running on fumes. And when those expire, so do you. This isn't over. It is, for now. Unless you'd care to stay for a walk in the park. to the sewer where he belongs. Are you disappointed we didn't destroy him? Nah, he always comes back. But knowing he's got to live with that humiliation almost makes it worth knowing you. For once, my failure of science has worked to our advantage. Congratulations, Hunter. Dracula's vampires suffered a major loss today. You deserve the credit, Doctor. You did good work today. The sunlight serum is so diluted it no longer poses a threat. The vampires have been cast back into the night where they belong. I don't think I can properly express my relief. Hunter. If you had not been there to lean on throughout all this, I do not know how I would have survived. This plague of vampires put stress on the whole team. We supported each other. You are too kind. I am glad I found such a welcoming family of heroes. And about that... Hunter. You should know that I will remain committed to the Midnight Sun's greater mission. You all helped me in my time of need. It is only fair that I return the favor. Your support is much appreciated. Marvelous. But before we move on, we must make one final decision regarding the Sunlight Serum. We? Oh, yes. I value your guidance. My prototype sample is no more, but I still possess my research notes. I could continue my experiments in the hopes of curing myself and maybe others, unless the risk of it falling into the wrong hands seems too great. I know the cost is great, but we cannot risk letting that information fall into the wrong hands. You must look for a cure elsewhere. I was worried you would feel that way. But I will honor the request. I have carried this cross for many years. I am used to the weight. I am sorry. It is for the best. Never apologize for doing the right thing, Hunter. I'll see you around.
I no longer think of you as a vampire. I just see you as Morbius. It seems we can finally put this ordeal with Morbius' serum behind us. Thankfully, we have more important things to focus on now. Hunter, thank you for not being overly harsh with Morbius. I only did what seemed to be right at the time. I would say you are wise beyond your years, but you have more years than most of us put together. Maybe that's what makes you so discerning. And still no wrinkles. Indeed. I am just glad that Morbius found some peace of mind. I am familiar with that journey. It's not easy. Be proud of your part in that, Hunter. Call me an idealist, but shining a Can't believe I'm saying this aloud, but I think I figured out Dracula's master plan. Go on. There is a Lilith connection, but it's not direct. Dracula is acting like he knows the world is coming to an end. Didn't expect him to be an apocalypse prepper, but here we are. Think of every play he's backed so far. Some of his plans overlap, right? I had noticed that. That's because he's throwing everything at the wall to see what sticks. It doesn't matter what plans fail. As long as one succeeds, he wins. The good news is, we're foiling his plans faster than he's setting them in motion. If we keep nipping these buds, he'll have nothing left. Let's debrief on the latest. Looks like Dracula's plan went up in smoke. See what I did there? I do. Is the Sunlight Serum truly gone? Dracula still has a supply, but it's barely effective, as you experienced. For a master plan, this one was a real dud. Morbius shamed Dracula. The Lord of Vampires will rid himself of the serum. I think you're right. Never mess with the sun. You mean the suns. But um shh. What? It's a... Mm, never mind. Central is tracking all mention of the Sunlight Serum, or anything like it. Unless it finds something, I think we're done here. Anything else on your mind? Thanks, Carol. See ya. So vampires aren't immune to the sun anymore? Make up your minds, people. See? I told you Morbius would come through for it. new, Hunter. Well, this was education. We're ready to make a move. Out of trouble. Need to pick me up? Farewell, Hunter. The gods are fickle. Uh, hey, can I ask a favor? Thanks, Hunter. It's not much, but I have managed to locate a few details.
How's it going, boss? Good. I need it. Sometimes, I even impress myself. Farewell. This should be useful. Even a sorcerer supreme can... Think Doctor Strange knows Merlin? Ready to work? Later. Doctor, one of those political spy thrillers Captain Rogers is always heads down in? It's actually a medical journal on bi-specific antibodies and the treatment of hematologic malignancies. Just some light reading. I hope you learned something that could give us an edge in battle. We need every advantage. I feel the same. I found that when I keep my mind sharp, I make better use of my body. In truth, I've been in survival mode so long, I don't know where to find my own off switch. Take a nap. If you were having trouble sleeping, maybe Nico could cast a spell of slumber. <laughs> I believe that spell is called listening to her talk about independent foreign films. Just do not overdo it. Our bodies need rest to function. Maybe your body does. I'm a nocturnal animal. I'm sorry. That was uncalled for. Maybe I am a little on edge. All the more reason for a break. You're right. I shall enjoy some respite. But then I'm jumping right back into this medical journal. It's just starting to get good. I think Dahlia might be hiding with the Morlocks. The Morlocks? Mutants who live in the tunnels beneath the city, and who stay away from the X-Men. There's a homeless encampment by an entrance to the Morlock tunnels. Vampires have attacked it three times this week. That cannot be a coincidence. Do you think the vampires are hunting this child? I don't know. The city's most vulnerable population is being erased, mutants and humans alike, disappearing from shelters, off the streets. The vampires go after anyone the world would not miss. Or even notice. Until now.
everyone you can. And keep your eyes open for Dahlia. I'm looking. Me too. I just don't like what I see. Our enemies came unprepared. Now it's the city's unhoused population. These depraved creatures have no shame. They do not seem to feel anything at all. Only their hunger drives them. And yet they're still on the trail of Dahlia. Then you're in the right place. At the very least, you can deny the vampires their next meal. Do not realize the trouble you are in, friend. We pick you. Much appreciated. Accept your defeat. In a city as renowned as New York, these people have still been left behind. The lack of empathy is not unique to this city, or this time. Society often turns its back on those who are different. And those with unusual abilities are even more likely to be shunned. Yes, we've all felt it in one way or another. Maybe it doesn't have to be that way for Dahlia. Some for the rest of us.
Don't get up, even if you can. Fortunate these are resourceful people. Most of them must have escaped before things got bad. To survive like this, they must always be looking over their shoulders. Let us hope that is what happened. This shall be of great help. these people. We can't accept anything less. Was your mistake in coming here? Brace yourself. A city as renowned as New York, these people have still been left behind. The lack of empathy is not unique to this city, or this time. Society often turns its back on those who are different. And those with unusual abilities are even more likely to be shunned. Yes, we've all felt it in one way or another. Maybe it doesn't have to be that way. fight. Are you prepared? I cannot 
possibly match your strength. I will deliver you from the... Accept your defeat. being watched let them watch give them no cause to fear us Shh. it's all right you'll be as good as new dahlia aurora what are you doing here I tried to find you at the orphanage, but... But what? It seemed you were in distress. I wanted to help. I'm not the one who needs help. Look around you. I can do more here than wearing a fancy yellow suit. The Morlocks took me in. They just welcomed me into their family. But now someone is trying to tear our family apart. I am so sorry. No, you're not. You say you're all about protecting mutants, but it's only the ones who live in that mansion. You don't even see people like us. That's not true. What happened here? We were attacked by creatures. We don't know what they are or what they want. Most of us fled after the last attack. Some are too wounded to move. I just need more time to heal them. What can we do? Really want to help? Stop those things from killing my family. These vampires are truly stockpiling victims. There is something much greater at work. It is never enough. There always seems to be a darker purpose waiting to reveal itself. At least it keeps us busy. The element. Some for the rest of us. This is what you came. Fate was already seen.
Regroup and await reinforcements. There's no shortage of minions coming to their aid. These Morlocks. I've not seen them before. These sewers have been home to all kinds. They've survived by avoiding unnecessary attention. And much like their counterparts on the surface, surprise me. I had expected better. I saw a move like that once, centuries ago. I'm sure the Morlocks will be grateful, in their own quiet way. Dahlia! It's over. You're safe. Thank you, Aurora. And the rest of you. We're not used to people looking out for us. Is there anything else we can do? No. We'll be alright. I've healed the others. We'll move where they can't find us. Dahlia. You don't have to be alone. The X-Men would welcome you. Thanks, but I'm not alone, and I can't abandon my family for yours. <sighs> All right. And if you ever need me... You'll be the first we call. Goddess be with you. All of you. I have a favor to ask. What do you need? Storm seems... off. I haven't seen her like this before. Can you speak with her? Of course, but why me? You both know what it means to lead. She sees you as a peer, whereas I will always be her student. You may be able to reach her in a way I cannot. All right. I will seek her out. Thank you. Oh, and don't tell her I asked you to do this. You're a woman of many talents. That will serve you well. You're pretty awesome yourself, Hunter. It's a relief to know Dahlia is safe. You were right about the Abbey being special. It's beautiful out here. I like to come here when I am feeling down. <laughs> Subtlety is not your strong suit. You want to ask about Dahlia, yes? 
Dahlia believes you only care about the X-Men who choose to join. Her words hurt you. Not exactly, but they've left me to wonder. And the act of self-reflection is often... uncomfortable. I do not follow. Her comment has caused me to think about how I treat my students. I don't think I choose favorites, but what if I do without realizing it? Regardless, I'm relieved to see her safe and happy with her found family. I'll keep worrying about her until the vampires are taken care of. I relate. The Midnight Suns are my family, and I share the same concerns over their safety. That almost sounds silly, worrying about people with powers. But I appreciate your words. It feels good to know I am not alone. I think the fear is natural. Having abilities puts targets on our backs. That is a good point. Just because we are strong does not mean we are invincible. <laughs> Where were you when I was a teenager? That's what leadership is. Knowing when to step in and when to respect boundaries. How do you know? They'll straight up tell you. Or you'll just feel it. Sounds complicated. It gets easier with time. Thank you for coming to check on me, Hunter. Leaders often have to take these burdens on by themselves. I am not a leader. Oh, please. I call it like I see it. Is there anything else? How did you meet Dahlia? I learned of her through the X-Men. Once mutants hit a certain age, their powers manifest. I went to offer Dahlia a place at Xavier's school, but she turned me away. Was that the only time you approached her? No. The second time I tried, the orphanage told me she had run away. I'm thankful she found companionship among the Morlocks. Do you think the vampires are after Dahlia or the Morlocks? It's hard to say. I do not know what they would want with either of them. Dahlia and the Morlocks are both mutants. Maybe the answer lies there. It's possible there's a connection there. I'd rather destroy the vampires before we find out for certain. I've never heard of a Morlock before. Morlocks are mutants who are visually distinct. I'm hesitant to call them different, but they avoid the X-Men. Different? Some Morlocks may have a gelatinous body, while others have horns growing from their head. Again, visually distinct. No, that was all. Of course. called yourself a leader many times. I've been in the position where I needed to make decisions for a team. I'm sure you have made many tough calls. I do what I can with the information I have. The same could be said of you. If I was put in the position to lead, I would. Isn't that how it goes? No one asks for this responsibility, but we do it. If that is the case, we should have matching jackets. I'll get right on that. Have you ever made a mistake? Who hasn't? Nobody is perfect. I've made my fair share of mistakes, and have done my best to learn from them. Does it always work? No. I am curious to hear how you handle failure. I make sure my team knows I'm sorry for letting them down. Sorry is nice, but action is what makes the apology count. Of course. I will make sure not to make the same mistake again. There you go. We'll be here to catch you if you fall. 
Give yourself some credit, Hunter. You're doing just fine. I had a fantastic time. Well done. I enjoyed spending time with you, Hunter. I forget how quickly time passes when I'm... She does not see it happening. No. Good to see you getting all buddy-buddy with Storm. How did you know I was just with her? I can, uh, smell her on you. Are you very familiar with her scent? We were... close. Let me guess, you will not elaborate. <laughs> nope. What do you know about the Morlocks? Morlocks aren't bad, you know. Who says they are? Well, society, mostly. Just because they can't pass as normal doesn't mean they deserve to be living in the sewers. Could they join the X-Men? They could. But the Morlocks don't trust us. Can't blame them. They don't trust anyone. In all my time... Anything else on your mind? What can you tell me about the Morlocks? I know mostly what you do. They're mutants who live beneath the streets of New York. I read through their S.H.I.E.L.D. file. For the most part, they're harmless. Why does S.H.I.E.L.D. have a file on harmless mutants? Groups of unknown mutants who live off the grid is a thorny subject in this country. I don't like it either, but until that changes, S.H.I.E.L.D. will keep tabs on them. Thanks, Carol. Catch you later. Must not... How did it go? Is she alright? We talked. I think I was able to lift her spirits. Oh, that is a relief. It is sweet that you care for her. Yes, yes. My heart of ice can melt on occasion. trouble. It's not much, but I have managed to locate a few details. Ooh, new coil. Let's get to work. Sometimes, I even impress myself. Always a pleasure. Don't ask. I'm sure you've heard the expression, getting a second wind, Hunter. Second wind? Is it related to your powers? <laughs> no, but could guess. It's when you're able to continue doing something difficult after you've been tired. That sounds very useful. What will you do with this new energy? I'm going to keep tabs on Dahlia and the Morlocks. Make sure nothing else happens to them. Is that what she wants? She wants me to keep my distance. But I can look out for friends from afar. Messy. 
I'm here if you need me. Hydra forces in this area are causing trouble. Let's take them down. Consider it. Not lost in. Get to the trucks and grab those artifacts before they roll out. That doesn't sound very challenging. centuries ago. I hate to be the bearer of bad news, but it looks like you've got another problem on your hands. One of the fallen. Running out of time. It 
advantage is mine. Stop them. Get to the artifact before they figure out what happened. Let's try this. Impressive. 